Jessa Duggar has been slammed for filming her daughter Fern making a huge mess inside the bathroom of their Arkansas home. The counting on Star's parenting decisions has been called into question by fans in the past. Jessa, 29, shared the video of her one-year-old daughter on her Instagram stories Tuesday. Captioned, the one time you catch the TP culprit in the act, the recording shows Fern unrolling toilet paper from its cardboard tube and pulling it across the bathroom. The little one periodically tears a piece loose, leaving an even larger trail of trash in her wake. Trace Atkins you're gonna miss, this plays along with the video, as Jessa continues her caption. She writes, you won't be picking up after them forever, one day they'll outgrow all of this, and you may find yourself missing the mess. 19 kids and counting fans reposted the video on a Duggar dedicated Reddit board. The post was titled, Jessa is going to miss having toilet paper strewn around her home I guess it's an improvement from piles of dirty nappies slash diapers. One fan commented, honestly, it feels very undugger like to showcase kids being kids like this. For a family that's so fond of blanket training. A second person responded, I wonder if some of the Duggar kids are very hands-off parents, due to their strict upbringing. It might even go too far in the opposite direction for some of them. Another Redditor joked, Jim Bob to Jessa, I'm not going to allow it, are you going to allow for that? While a fourth commenter added, the cuteness the curiosity the unmade bed, mattress and box springs on the Florno bed frame, the random freezer in the corner. Come on Jessa, it isn't relatable it's messy. Jessa left fans, baffled after giving them a tour of her renovated Arkansas home. The 29-year-old confused viewers after admitting she keeps her deep freezer in her bedroom instead of the kitchen. Jessa showed off the freezer tucked in a corner, behind the door of the bedroom she shares with her husband, Ben Seewald, 27. In a video on her YouTube channel, she explained that they moved it there from its old place in the living room. The mother of three admitted, it's probably not the most aesthetically pleasing thing to have it here, but it's ten times better than out in the main living space and honestly, we don't really see it, like when you walk in, it's just perfectly tucked behind the door. I guess it just kind of blends in there. While Jessa seemed happy with the freezer's new home, critics were baffled by the odd decorating move. One wrote on Reddit, that is such an odd placement for a deep freezer. Another added, lol, yes. Why put something in the kitchen, when you can grab some frozen tater tots or chicken nuggets from the bedroom freezer? A third posted, they don't want to ruin their kitchen aesthetic, but they'll ruin their bedrooms? What is that madness? Six months ago, Jessa and Ben decided to dump their savings into the remodel of a new house, following the cancellation of her reality show. Earlier this month, she gave fans a first look at the finished result. Jessa had fans fearing for her two sons' safety after she posted an Instagram photo of them in a dangerous situation. The former TLC star has four children, Spurgeon, six, Henry, five, Ivy, three, and Fern with her husband Ben, but it was her two boys that were featured in the Instagram photo. The photo shows a very guilty-looking Henry climbing down from a stool that is on top of a bench. Spurgeon's back was facing the camera so he could hold the stool, steady, for his brother. The two of them were attempting to get something from a cabinet that has school supplies in it. Jess's caption was five paragraphs long, but it had a good message for her followers. She said, moms are everyday heroes. Proof, they can disappear behind a door for 30 seconds, while continuing to use their sixth sense to perceive any possible danger in the rest of the house. She continued, new Seawald house rule, no stacking anything on top of anything and then standing on top of the second anything. Many fans in her comment section were grateful that Spurgeon was there to lend a helping hand. As previously mentioned, this isn't the first time Jessa has been called out by fans for bad or dangerous parenting. Her one-year-old daughter, Fern, was spotted holding metal handcuffs last month in the background of a family video. Baby Fern has been photographed in a dangerous situation while she was taking a nap. Fans got nervous for the kids' safety when Spurgeon and her older daughter Ivy were sliding down large rocks during a day of homeschooling. Jessa also got dragged for allowing her children to eat pizza while sitting on a dirty driveway.